Hey guys, in today's video I'm going to be doing a sound test on my 10 inch bookshelf speakers. All it is is a 10 inch Boss Audio woofer and let me tell you, for the price, man, look, it moves the whole box. This thing doesn't flex. I still haven't really broke them in because I blew the other ones because you guys might have saw that other video, but I did make another video on this and it didn't really sound that good so I had to upgrade it. And right here, I got a piece of wood in there and I glued it in and I sealed it up. So that cuts this off. So this little mid-range has this upper half of the box for itself and I got a crossover in there. That's given this all the power that I give it from the amp. And then the tweeter obviously, that has a, a little breaker on it so it doesn't get as much power. And then this is only 50 watts. So this flexes, this actually sounds really good ever since I did that. And then I, uh, this is where the grills clip in and it leaves holes. So I actually cover those up. Oh, the yeah, box is a little messed up. And then there's the inside of the port. Actually, you can see the wire, but yeah. But I'll show you guys the other one over here. Basically, it's just the same one. You, I got my flashlight on and I'm using my, uh, I got my blinds open or whatnot. So if you could get some sunlight, it makes them look glossy. But um, yeah, same thing here. I got this. This box is a lot nicer than the other one. I did a lot better job on this one. You don't see anything. I actually painted the inside of the box black. And uh, actually with the slot on there, this box with this sub, it's tuned to 40 hertz and this sub kicks. Yeah, that's beautiful, ain't it? Yeah. Oh yeah, and I got my 15 in a new box. This box is uh, 30 hertz. This sucker plays lows now. But, uh, anywho, let me grab this. We're gonna pause that. And then, oh, I got my little music phone here. Oh, let me go over the song. That's the song, it's blank. Oh, I dropped it, my bad. I'm bad at making videos anymore. I just want to point out that the bass isn't all the way up, so 
just because this isn't moving that much, trust me, I can make a move. I'm just getting sound quality, not bass test. I didn't know the song ended that fast. Oh. Anyways, so I guess that wraps up this video. And uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed that little uh, clip of these uh, bookshelf speakers playing. And I have to say, if you guys go back, you guys can always go back and watch my other video. You don't have to. I'll actually show you the crap you want first. That's what was in there before. These things slam now. Ever since I put the slot in there, that board, and tuned it down to 40 hertz. Look at that. I guess even got a sticker on it. Crappy. There's a magnet. If you guys don't believe me, that it sucked. That one, that magnet's like three times the size of this. That stuff can handle some power. And I know Boss Audio's underrated, and I'm not trying to overrate it, but these suckers can handle some power. Not even warm at all. And I was, I was getting them pretty good. And uh, just want to point out that any distortion is for my mic. And if my 15 kind of like messed up my mic a little bit, so I hope it doesn't sound too bad. But I kept the bass down so it wouldn't clip my mic. And if you heard any noise, like air noise, definitely the port. That port pushes so much air. And that's how it gets the right tuning because it's literally just a... I think that's like a two inch, three inch long port. But either way, this video's gone on long enough, and uh, hope you guys enjoy, and I'll see you guys in the next video.